All right, uh, Daryl Brigantine. Good morning, Daryl. Good morning, Don. How are you? I'm fine. Hope you're well. Well, I hope you're ready for uh, this uh, weekend's uh, parade on the beach. You're going to be down there. Why? What are you going to do? Throw sand balls at me or something? We love it. We've been doing it for the past two years. Been voting Republican all my life. I I must say the uh, democracy in action last night was great. It uh, really was. The people have spoken. Yes, and I I'm the biggest fan of of the mayor and what he's done, and the Republicans have been great. Uh, although, much like well, with the Benghazi issue with Nancy Pelosi. She mentions there's nothing to see here. I'm afraid that some of the mismanagement of overtime funds might make it a little, well, a little interesting. And I, I'm really hoping the mayor will sort that out and that the absolutely the, uh, couldn't agree with you more. We uh, certainly want to see that all get worked out and just. Well, if the Republicans have any hope of uh, recapturing uh, the majority there, they had better, you know, do the, the job that's uh, cut out for them, the people put them there for. And if there are some problems, get to the bottom of it and solve it. And, and, uh, Mr. 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 Uh, well, Williams, I just want to say that the firemen and the policemen and the brigantine and the EMS and the beach, they're some of the finest people. Yes, they are. But, um, there might have been some oversight that was missing and we really want the mayor to clean that up because we believe that could really hurt him in the november election if he does not clean up that overtime mess and he's too good of a man we we need him and uh hopefully uh i'm i'm, I'm almost i would bet on it